I just love wandering into a church that I've not been to for a long time because you never know what you're going to find. These buildings are absolutely full of treasures and that's one of the reasons that I come back to them time and time again because there's always something new to see. This is the church of St Martin in Fincham. It's not one of the great medieval Norfolk churches, but it still has a lot of interest. An angel roof, a wonderful clear story to bring light into the building. But we've come here today to see just one object. It's fantastic Romanesque font. I must say, to start with, that this font doesn't belong in this church. This was one of the villages that had two medieval churches. And in the 18th century, this one was expelled from the other church and came here. But what a treasure it is. This is the west face, the side that you don't often get to see when you walk in the door. And it depicts the baptism of Christ. I mean, he's shown in a font because in the 12th century, when this was made, baptisms were always in fonts. But of course, at the time of Christ, fonts didn't exist. And uh, it's a rather stylized representation with the Holy Spirit in the form of a dove coming down to him. These wonderful Romanesque arches help us to date it to the middle of the 12th century. But it's when we get to the other sides that things start to liven up a little bit. On the north side of the font is my favourite representation. It shows Adam and Eve. Here's Eve. She's just taking the apple from the tree of good and evil. She's rather coy, isn't she? the way she's covering herself up. And the image I particularly like is Adam here. He's rubbing his head as if to say to Eve, I told you not to do that. On the south side, we have the nativity. Here's the star in the east. Here's baby Jesus in his manger. And this lovely ox and ash. They're rather fun, aren't they? I'm not quite sure who this is. It's probably Joseph. And here a man with a staff is undoubtedly a shepherd following the star. On the east face of the font, facing down into the church, are the three wise men. They're almost like triplets, aren't they? in the way in which they hold their hands. English parish churches are one of our finest repositories of architecture and art. And I hope I've shown you in this short film that a visit to St Martin's Church in Fincham, Norfolk, is well worthwhile, if only to look at its wonderful Romanesque font. <laughs>